So, hello everyone. I recently started to build this Lego V Twin, and I hope you guys are all having a great day currently. But this engine currently is like most of my projects, just not running yet. So, what I need to do is back here I have this little makeshift timing chain that uses a like track piece. It's, it's kind of old and it doesn't work. It just, it straight up does not work. And that's why I am not going to use it. Okay. And I need to order a timing chain off the internet because I don't have one yet. And it's just like my SOHC, but I never end up ordering that one. So my SOHC engine is most likely going to be it. I can say most likely. It is scrapped. I don't have it anymore. It's mainly because I wanted to make an OHV push rod engine, but it didn't run and I was kind of discouraged and I just got rid of it but this engine has single valve has the single valve system you can see it has a four by you can see that on the side four by four pistons so yeah and I know this looks a lot like KF plus design I did not follow his tutorial I'm not that weird or rude or something like that I just was lightly basing mine off his design. There's a couple of different things like the valves. The stroke length, is, I believe, is different for the valves. The valves are definitely different. Some of these things like the intake and the manifolds are a little, a little the same and a little different. Like the timing chain on the end is definitely the different than the K pluses. So yeah, I think it just needs a lot more work and a little bit more time. <clears throat> The seals and everything should be good. It does have the gaskets. Let me show them to you guys. As you can see, it has the gaskets. I made them out of masking tape instead of using paper. Because I believe, I actually have watched his tutorial. No, I've never followed it, but I have watched it. And he said that paper gaskets aren't necessarily proper. I think they are aligned right. But, but that's just what he used. So as you can see, there's the stroke length. They're just five studs. Instead of doing like six, <clears throat> which I believe what is what KF Plus done. And, and yeah, it runs. It doesn't run yet, I shouldn't say it runs. <clears throat> it doesn't run yet, it needs a lot more work. So yeah, I'm just working on it. <clears throat> Probably gonna wait until the timing chain comes and then I'll make a video about it, most likely this week and I know I haven't I want to make a video about my clutch and how to use it but that'll be coming up soon so yeah guys yeah so it's pretty cool and I would recommend if you guys want me to I might make a tutorial about it I know if personally you should just follow KF Pluses because it probably will run better than this piece of trash but yeah so yeah there's a couple extra parts like crankshafts and stuff I want to order off the internet too so like I can make an inline four or something like that. I'm not quite sure. Future plans, they're not really currently planned for the future. I do have a video on my truck coming up. That's what I did in a video a short, I guess you could short video. And if you guys want me to, I guess I could put the V twin in it. I'm not really sure yet. I the only thing is, is this the width of this V twin is the same width as the truck body, so I'd have to like cut out the sides of it. Not with, like scissors or something, like just take away part of the build. So yeah. See you guys later. Hope you guys have had a great day and a Saturday. So see you guys all later.